Cindy and I are going over a really cool old move. It'll be like archaeology of wrestling. Uh, it was uh, one of your requests, so let's go over it right now. Earl McCready, in his book um, about wrestling, he likes to do this move. He was a one of the best Canadian wrestlers Canada ever produced. He came down to Oklahoma to wrestle in folk style. He did uh, the Olympics in freestyle, and he won uh, what's called like the British Empire Cup. So I'm sure that'd be like the equivalent of the Commonwealth Games uh, nowadays. Uh, so let's go over his favorite hammerlock. Here, it's gonna be weird. This is, this is a part you're still gonna see, not so much in freestyle, but in pro wrestling. But this is what he says is his entry. So two on one. Pull this out, okay? Then you're going to spin almost like a, a, a shoulder roll. So you're gonna be like this, you're gonna come up, and then over, back like this, okay? And then from here, okay, so you got this going up the back, then you're going to trip the shin with your foot and push them forward, so like this, okay? Then come around the side, spear up this way, okay? And then instead of grabbing like their, their tricep area or their, um, their trapezius, you grab your own wrist, grab the bicep area, and here we are. In the move, the, in, the, in his book, he describes the partner grabbing their own, their own hands in order to relieve some of the pressure there. Because this is uncomfortable on the shoulder, especially if you're not flexible, okay? But, this is the move, and Earl's kind of pulling the guy up just like that. Okay, that's the move. Now that we went through this big long sequence, let's go ahead and like kind of do it in a little bit more uh, smooth fashion here. So it'll be here. Okay, get the control of the wrist. Two on one. You're gonna separate it from their body, and you're gonna go through that that space in the armpit. So step, come up, back. Okay, now that you're behind them, keep that wrist going up, their back, trip this way, and then you're gonna swing your legs over, get, get that bar arm, grab your own wrist, then grab the tricep. There you go, that's your move. So from here, you can fall different ways to go for uh, all the various pins, right? You can fall backwards, or it also depends if they grab their wrist or not. Right here you can set up uh, the different types of uh, uh, bar arms, or you can, it, there's so many ways you can go from here. So we'll just leave it at the move the way it's described in the book. All right, so let's have Cindy take me down. So we'll do it from a different angle here. Actually, let's do it this way. Okay, okay from here, yep. And I'm sitting around and I'm flat my head. There we go. That's it. Yeah, you can totally go for head scissors too. It's, it's right there for you. All right, so go ahead and keep the request coming. We'll see you in the next video.